What's up everybody, 915 Mang here doing a video today. I got a few products that I got from Marine Depot and Elos. And I'm going to be trying these products out on my own 150 gallon reef tank. But first I want to give a shout out to Marine Depot and Metro Cat for sending me these items. Also thank you to Elos for sending me these products to try out. Um, the products that I got are fish food and... Uh, it's a bacteria that you pit inside of your reef tank and it's going to pretty much clean up any detritus and you can also use it for newly uh, aquariums. Basically it's a bacteria and it's going to help clean up all the nasty detritus and things like that and also give your aquarium a boost. I'm really excited to add these blood worms into the tank, um, you know, just to change up the diet of the fish, give them uh, something else other than brine shrimp kind of you know change it up so that way they're not always eating the same thing over and over again it looks like the fish are starting to get excited more uh, they're starting to swim around they know that they're about to get fed and uh, if you guys have used this product below let me know in the comments this is the first time that I put it in my tank and uh, we're going to see how they act and go from there this is what it looks like as you can see, it's in the fluid. I'm just going to keep it in the fluid. Um, once I open it, I will refrigerate it. But you can check it out, all the worms right there. I'm going to use a spork. Uh, I'm not going to use any of my utensils. I'm going to use a plastic spork that I have. And I'm going to use that just for feeding these fish. So let's go ahead and pit this in the tank. I know a lot of people use blood worms. And uh, I thought it was going to be pretty messy. But it actually is okay. Um, I thought it was going to pollute the water, make it all cloudy. But it seems like the fish are eating it all up. I did kind of speed this up a little bit. But everybody's eating it and it's doing good. So good product so far. And it actually, one little can is going to last me quite a bit. Because when I fed it, I didn't overfeed it. I just put enough food in there until the fish ate everything up. And then I went ahead and uh, put some more food in and just watch them so yes i recommend that you guys go ahead and add some of this stuff to your fish's diet uh, you could always use my coupon 915 mang at marine depot when you're getting ready to check out just punch that in there and you'll get yourself a 10 percent discount see if you like it or not fish seems to like it pretty good and uh, you know what a little bit really does go a long way Another product that I'm really excited to use is this A1 and uh, basically it's going to clean up my aquarium. I have a lot of detritus. I was measuring this out it came out to about uh, 6 ml. Then I just squirted in the aquarium in some high flow. But you know what, from now on I just started doing the cap and I used started doing it uh, every time that I do a water change. Like I said, it, it, it's introducing bacteria to your aquarium but I'm excited to use this stuff because uh, I've done other things like carbon dosing which is and I go the cheap route and I use uh, distilled vinegar from Walmart but this stuff is actually bacteria designed for your aquarium it's not just off-the-shelf uh, products like vinegar and things like that um, so I'm curious to see if this stuff works really good and uh, I just want to share with you something else I won this protein skimmer from my buddy Rob's uh, Aquatics and uh, basically I won a light but he told me since I do fish uh, why don't I go ahead and get this protein skimmer and he sent it and it's pretty cool I'm going to be using it for my uh, frag tank below my 25 gallon innovator marine tank and I just want to show you some of the goodies that I got because he like stuffed it with some other items so thank you very much rob i can use all of this stuff you know little pump right there this is the actual protein skimmer some uh goodies right here um and some fish food uh he like really hooked it up all i won was the light and he gave me you know the protein skimmer 
and I, I can't wait to use this stuff and that's just part of the people that you meet in the aquarium hobby you throw contests you know I've thrown contests I've won and it's good to win stuff and it's also good to throw contests back but uh, check out that light that I got um, I'm gonna probably be using that for uh, mountain biking or something like that because as the summer comes I'm gonna go ahead and need a little bit more light because I'll probably do some evening rides when it's not when the sunlight's not pounding down but check it out man I want all this stuff again big shout out to my buddy Rob go check him out on YouTube and uh, pretty cool but the next video that I'm gonna be doing for you guys uh, I'm gonna be doing like a solid update I'm gonna do an update on the 150 and also the 25 gallon lagoon frag system you know double decker nanos uh, frag tank that I got going on but that's what this channel is about you know mixing it up product reviews tank updates uh, updates on other people tanks that I get to interview uh, in my area so I'm just gonna keep it like that have fun with it and uh, make sure you guys like and subscribe I just want to show you a little bit of top down on the 150 um, the last video I did I ended up buying some corals and uh, these are just what I have in stock right now um, I've glued them to the overflow and uh, they're coloring up really nice they're doing good and uh, I can't wait to show you that other update because I got a lot of things that I have planned for this tank and I'm gonna change it up the next thing time you see this tank be totally uh, different so thanks guys have a good one like subscribe and you guys take care